A group of firefighters in Papillion are missing one of their own. Rich Higgins died at his home in February at the age of 90. New tonight, KE2 News Watch 7's Cal Larson reports on his life of service. It's a huge hole. Uh, 65 years of service, that's hard to replace. You won't replace that today. Standing in the same spot this photo was taken, Russ Zeeb remembers his longtime friend and colleague, Rich Higgins. Rich Higgins to me was a neighbor, a friend, a brother, uh, and a, a community servant. Rich Higgins joined the Papillion Volunteer Fire Department in 1959. It's not the only hat he wore. And if we were hanging Christmas lights, if we were cleaning up, uh, if we were serving dinner for somebody, he was there. Rich was also an army vet, a mail carrier, a bus driver, and a family man. A family that extended into the Papillion Volunteer Fire Department. His family is still one of us. Uh, Beverly, his wife, is known as the mom of PVFD. And she's mother to everybody. Zeb has story after story of his longtime friend. The dinners they shared, the visits to one another homes. He's left thinking of the blueprint Higgins left. I hope and pray that my daughter turns out that way and that other generations, you know, uh, turn out the same way. Rich's family wrote that he was the epitome of selflessness, exactly how Zeb hopes his friend is remembered. If I have one wish in the world, it's that everyone remembers Rich Higgins for who he was, remembers his family for who they were, and remembers that, uh, that there are good people in this country and in this city uh, that, uh, that are there to help whenever you need it. Cal Larson, KTV, News Watch 7.